Hello, and in today's video, we're going to be talking about the best stealth outfit in Kingdom Come Deliverance. So let's get started. The first item is the black hood. The hood is a simple head covering, covering that co covers the head and also the shoulders and the upper body with a short caper mantle. This is uh, this will make you less uh, visible and more or not as conspicuous as you would be. It can be found on uh, it can be found, excuse me, uh, it can be found on bandits, but there's no simple way to buy it. But a good way to get it is if you get an ar attack by armed peasants. They usually will have one on them. Next item we're gonna be talking about is the dark Saxon gam gambeson. The gambeson is a padded quilted jacket. It provides protection in combat and can be combined with nail or plate armor. This will make you less conspicuous and has no noise. It can be found in the artisan's armor armorsmith or Tay or Sasa. It's a good piece that'll make you very stealthy. The next we have our leather gloves. Soft deerskin gloves provides basic hand protection. This will just make it good, just so it just completes the outfit. It makes you look stealthy and less visible. It can be found and bought with the Sasso Armorsmith. Necklace doesn't really matter, it doesn't really do anything. But next we have the padded coif. Make sure it's the padded cough because the, pa the dark padded one has one noise. The padded coif is usually worn as a helmet linear liner, but can be worn alone as a basic head protection in combat. This will just cover your head and make you less visible, and so people don't notice you. Make sure it's a black variant. There are other variants like red, green, and stuff. Make sure you buy this one. This can be found in bandits slash tailors. The tailors in Rite and Sasa. Next we have the quiet dark shoes. But there's actually two two shoes I don't have with me. One is the leather of uh, the leather boots. The reason if you would want this one or the other is they both do something with the visibility and noise. As the quiet dark shoes have no noise but adds one to visibility but the leather boots take one away from visibility but add one noise so it's like a trade-off would you rather noise or visibility but i would prefer the quiet dark shoes so you don't make as much noise and one may not be a huge difference but it actually could be next this is silver ring you don't need that and the last the last uh piece of the outfit are the tight black hose these can be found at any tailor in Ratai and sasso it's on the bailiff of scallets bailiff of ushits and Andrew, the innkeeper at, at the end of the glade. You could probably find it on his corpse, the Scalots Bailiff in Scalots, as is his name. But there are high level bandits there, so if you're not high enough level, don't try it. Ushits, you'd have to like sneak into his home. But the easiest one is Andrew. Is the end of the glade is in a populated town, and you can wait for him to be in his bed, or is sitting alone at the tavern. knock him out and take it off of him i'll also have a guide coming out on how to remove the stolen effect from any goods but if but until then keep it in your trunk at the retain mill or any tavern or if you're late enough in the game that little house in the lower castle perkstein until the stolen effect is removed so you know it doesn't get taken off to you by guards but this is about the best stealth outfit as it provides the lowest visibility conspicuation and noise so I hope you guys enjoyed this stealth outfit video. If you'd like me to make any more tutorials on Kingdom Come Deliverance, then please leave it in the comment section below. And I'll be making two other outfit guides for charisma and armor. And of course, I will leave a link in the description of the forum that I found this outfit on, as I did a little bit of my own research as well. There will be the other two outfits if you just want to look at them, before you, before, even if you don't want to watch the video. But of course, I'll have the next two videos videos out in a couple of weeks. 
Thank you guys for watching.